Hey guys, what is going on? So I just realized that I didn't really get that much footage from this past week uh, at all and I don't really like that I'm so off my YouTube game because it's really important to me that I get videos out and that I make time for this and so essentially what happened last week is that I went home last Friday and I didn't I was out pretty late so I didn't get a chance to edit the video until Saturday so my plan was to edit the video and then upload it on Saturday and while I was editing it I was like 20 minutes in and I was like this vlog is literally so boring like nobody's gonna want to watch this I basically was in this room the entire time and it was just like so boring and since it was boring to edit I knew that it was going to be boring for me to rewatch it which means that I figured it would be pretty boring for the audience to watch it if you guys watched my first week of school, it was probably one of the worst weeks of my life. And then if you guys would have watched the second week, you would have heard me talking about some more positive things that I've been getting into. Essentially what happened last week is that I started to get involved in my school. So one of the organizations that I joined is uh, called IUB and essentially it is a club that handles all of the uh, like special events and you know extracurricular type social gatherings outside the classroom. And there is a board of people and there are like what seven directors or something like that and then below them are called members. So I'm a member and I'm actually been going to several of these meetings and they've just been really uh, fun and enjoyable and it's great to meet new people my mom is calling me give me one second hello mom that phone call ended up taking a little bit longer than I thought it was going to so I don't really remember where I left off but I think I was talking about my club so yeah that that's going on I was thinking about joining a bowling league and I tried to get somebody from my IUB club to join with me but he said no because he has so much other things going on and so essentially I ended up not even joining not because he didn't join but mainly because I didn't know how much of a time commitment it was going to take up and more so how much of a weekend commitment it was going to take up. Now I've been going home every single weekend since I've been at school and so you know it's important for me to see my mom, my boyfriend, my stepsister, all that good stuff stuff uh so essentially i just like um you know having my weekends which is also why i'm trying not to get a job that runs on the weekends another thing that i kind of wanted to address is going home now people have been giving me all sorts of different feedback about their opinions on me coming home on the weekends and i'm kind of sick of hearing about it so i kind of just want to address it i feel that Let's start from the beginning. I have been wanting to go to a university outside of my hometown for a very long time, like very long time. So since like high school, I've been dreaming about going to a university that's out of the state of Illinois. And so I've been thinking about California, Florida, uh, Arizona, you know, just like beautiful places, beautiful weather, just like loving life, enjoying, you know, everything that's going on around you and you know there are different perks to different places so i'm trying to be in the world of social media and you know public figures and so it's important for me that i eventually make my way to california even if it's like you know doing business trips out there and then coming home and then doing business trips and then coming home uh arizona my cousin goes to school in arizona and you know he loves life he loves the vibes that are there and i've honestly been to arizona several times i have family there and i love arizona too and it's awesome and so i just i just really you know thought that it would be great for me to be able to live there for you know school and stuff and then lastly florida uh you know disney world's there it would be cool if i could you know meet somebody hypothetically who loved disney too and we could like road trip to disney world and you know have like a weekend there or whatever and then you know go back to school so those are the kinds of all the things that i was thinking about when i was thinking about my dream of going out to school in you know a state other than illinois now of course everybody knows that i am in illinois and 
being in Illinois and only being a couple hours away from home, I have been going home every single weekend. Everybody knows this. I've talked about it. I've shared it. I've been home so people know that I'm there. Uh, and I just love being home. I don't know. I think that it's... I think that my relationship with my family will always be there and so you know I wasn't as concerned about that even though you know I love seeing my mom and I really like realized that being alone I need my mom like every time I you know like okay for example the other day my electricity went out and when I was moving in the electricity also went out in my room so called my mom and I was like, mom, my electricity went out, what the heck do I do? And uh, she was like telling me all these different things. She was with my grandma and grandpa at the time. So my grandpa was like saying stuff about what I should do and how I need to find the circuit box and you know, whatever with that. Uh, so yeah, basically I just call my mom whenever I need something and I kind of in the type of person who just expects her to pick up and be like, yeah, Anna, you need to do this. That being said, uh, I really like, you know, need her and so that's why i'm just like happy at this point of my college experience that i have her uh it's important for my relationship with tom that we see each other that we're physically there for each other uh tom's family has weddings like every single year because his family is so big and just so that you know i feel like i'm part of the family and i want to be there for his family I, you know, like going to those types of things, you know, those are big events in his family's lives and I just like being there for them. That's what I'm doing now and that's my choice and it is the biggest pain in the butt to travel from here and home and here and home. I took the bus for the first time last weekend and for those who don't know, there is a bus that comes uh, to several stops at my school, several stops at another school, and then it goes to the suburbs in public locations, and then people obviously need to get picked up. Tried the bus, uh, and honestly, it was just like a load off my back, but the bus on the way to the suburbs took four hours to get there. And then after that four hours, I had to drive a half hour home Tom picked me up and I it took a half hour to get uh, to his house um, I've talked about this before maybe not in this vlog, but I Never really get a good night of sleep these days uh, You know, I have two roommates and I hear them Talking I hear their alarms go off. They probably hear me talking and my alarms going off, you know, so it's just like It gets difficult it is week three of school uh for those who don't know there are 16 weeks in a school semester at least for my school semesters so uh yeah it's kind of kind of crazy um things are going by fast things are changing things are getting better and there are definitely things that could be approved upon which my mom is very supportive of helping me with but yeah that's what's going on. I'm going home this weekend. Super excited to see my boyfriend. I get to see my mom tonight. It's just, uh, the weekends are so relieving. I am going to end my video here. I will probably make this its own separate little video, so I'm not going to be vlogging in it at all, but I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!